All right, so keep West End weird, but not too weird. Just a special kind of weird, only when it's pertaining to social issues and not when you're broaching topics that other people have already decided are relevant or um, certainly pointless. Right, so in this group, Keep West End Weird, I've decided to take a more active role as someone who's going to make content be there to look at and make the group somewhat more of a fountain of information than it already was. It already is great. People post relative things to West End, things that are happening in the community, how to be involved, all sorts of good stuff coming out of it. And I just decided I was going to throw heaps of new stuff in the mix and see what happens. And it's been a really fun thing to do for me. Um, people have responded fairly well across the board. I'd say we got some good reactions. And But we've hit some kind of wall where people are just like, alright, I've had enough. Um, there's been too much of these posts of a certain type of nature that I don't like. And they're not relevant to West End. So... My problem with this idea that they're not relevant to West End is that I can see beyond the scope of what you think might be relevant to West End into what could actually be relevant to West End. So let me lay it out for you. If you're in West End, or even if you're not in West End, if you're a person and someone shares information with you and you ingest the information or you come to the party and sort of mix and mingle, then you're going to be changed, something's going to happen you're going to have to think a little bit more, you're going to, whatever, something's going to happen and there's going to be, like, motion through time, people share their sort of understandings, their intellect, their impressions, their imprints with each other and they take from the discussion, from the exchange and grow and that's how we grow as people intellectually. Now, if I post things that aren't particularly geologically relevant to the area of West End or politically relevant to the the already covered things that are happening in West End it's because I'm coming from a different angle here I'm not really interested in telling you about how the Abso site is is not good or whatever or more people in West End is is gonna happen and it's gonna be scary and bad or I'm more interested in this group in particular as a forum for this stuff right and my problem that I'm coming up against here is that people are seeing what I'm putting on, on there, like some three astronauts from NASA going to the moon, coming back from the moon, and then being all like, hmm, shit, that moon was shit, ah, fucking like, this whole experience has just been terrible, I don't like the moon really, and I'm pretty un unhappy to be sitting here getting interviewed about it. And I think that that's like, weird, like, when I was a child I was always taught that the moon was close and reachable in a, in a big rocket ship that explodes fuel out its butt to get all the way up there and it takes a little while and then once they get there they can bounce around on the moon and it was a big deal a real big deal and it was never like are you sure that really happened like did that really happen like it was always that's what happened of course and then one day I heard that maybe it didn't happen there's people out there who believe that it didn't happen and there's people out there who have investigated and come to conclusions that it didn't happen and so I decided to look into it too. And what I arrived at is irrelevant to your to your opinion and irrelevant to what you think about it. And geologically irrelevant to West End and politically irrelevant to the, the current affairs of West End. But deception and the uncovering of truth is always relevant to all people. So that's kind of like Checkmate, I don't know, I guess, I don't, I'm not trying to one-up everybody and always have the best answer. I'm really just trying to interact with everyone on the broadest scope possible by finding out where those boundaries are with people and begging, sort of begging people to just suspend their suspension of disbelief that they keep for movies and then they come back into reality and think everything is real and realise that there's no border there. It's not like fiction and reality and never the twain shall meet. It's, it's a, little, a little bit more complicated than that. 
And the reason I post these things is to have intellectual discussion with people and achieve a deeper understanding of these topics. Right? So, bounce around ideas. Not so much bounce around, oh no, there's facts here, look at this link. Facts telling you that this is it. Because this, it's like, mm, believing things on the internet is dangerous. Believing things wholeheartedly any, anyway is also a surefire way to be, I don't know, misled, deceived. Cool. Somebody's busking. Right. So, just fucking think about it. It's not even hard. Like, if you're not interested in whether or not the moon landing was real or not, just glaze over it like everything else you glaze over. Like, it's not a big deal. It's not a big deal. It's not a big deal. If you've got a problem with me using this platform as a platform, then fucking, that's okay, you can have a problem. That's your problem. If you want to stand up and push me off the platform, then <laughs> go for gold. That's funny. I think that's funny. And I encourage people to, to feel inspired to do things. So if you feel inspired to do something, do it. But this whole, like, oh, this is just dumb, like, so stupid, like, is it? <laughs> is that where you're at with it now? Okay, so is that as much as you can, like, get out about it? This is dumb, man. Fucking hate this bullshit. This is bullshit. <sighs> People are so strange. We're all so strange. The way that our, our psycho psycho psychology works and our interactions with each other in, in the flesh and on the internet... It's a marvellous, wonderful, crazy, interesting, intricate thing. Connecting with people directly through the internet, for me, I find is more like, like a source to source, straight from me without all my masks on to you without all your masks on, because we don't have to go outside and get all dressed up and do all the ritual things we do before we leave our houses. It's me in my house to you in your house. It's like the potential is, in, is immense, it's enormous, but people get dressed up before they start typing and they get it's so easy to get carried away when you're just talking shit because you got that safety barrier like you don't actually have to look at the person in the eye and and talk a bunch of nonsense it's you just, just smash it out and then and then say whatever and you guys are just dumb but I want more than that I think that we're all capable of more than that and I think that the internet has so far been used very efficiently for selling heaps of shit and monitoring everybody and you know like um, marketing and advertising and everything but there's still a oodles and oodles and oodles and unknown potentials for people like us we the people the people who aren't like, screwing everyone over with their intention on a daily basis to sort of figure out interesting new effective ways of communicating and collaborating Creating new art forms, can you dig it? If you don't dig it, get a shovel. <laughs> oh, but seriously, there's some... Um, there's a reason I'm posting weird outlandish things that seem like utter nonsense. And it's not because I want you to think I'm a lunatic. It's because I can see truth in them, and I want to know if anyone else can see truth in them. Hmm. I think that's actually really it, too. Cool. So, I might do this again. It feels good for me to, to make all these sounds with here. If you've enjoyed hearing what I've had to say, then uh, just let me know. Yeah, rad. So keep West End weird, but not too weird, but not a... Uh, no, oh, you know, just just don't worry about it. Just um, just watch more TV. Just don't even think about anything. Just move to New Farm, Carondale. People won't in. People will talk to you about the news, the races, or the or the game. <laughs> but if you don't like what's going on, what I'm saying, just go and find someone who f who providing information that you can lap up. Just go and lap up something else. Like if you're not lapping this up, then lap something else up. Alright, be peaceful.